photos from a storm chaser. <clears throat> Get this guy from Unit 2 Connecting to Nature. So, who is this storm chaser? And what is a storm chaser? Well, if you haven't watched any of my science videos, you might already know what storm chaser is. If you want to already skip out and you're too lazy to actually watch those videos, then read on. All right, so what is a storm chaser? Well, a storm chaser is as a person, usually a scientist or like a non-professional, chasing storms to study about them. Usually you have to be a professional. If you aren't a professional and you consider yourself a storm chaser, well, you're mad. Now, what do storm chasers do and what's their job? Well, storm chasers' jobs are to Literally, as their name says, chase storms and then track them down and figure out about them. Hmm, let's see, let's see. Hmm, yes, yes. And so then, why do we have to chase storm when we can get it struck by lightning and die in the process and not tell anything? Firstly, we are in vehicles. Secondly, we have these very, very cool gadgets. And thirdly, we get a lot of treats. And then, how does it work, all this? Well, you know like how there's a lot of things that in the world that just can't be happening, and how increases of technology can happen throughout this world? Well, this is how balls to AirPods have gone all the way to there. We might even figure out that there is time to actually storm chase. Now, there was this woman called Edmund Col Camille Seaman, Kalsili Seaman, this woman over here, who's an Indian, uh, no, not like India Indian, uh, uh, American Indian, where she just was in a fishing tribe. And she learned about the clouds by her grandfather in a spiritual and scientific way, both in, oh, well, it's both in a way. And also, also that she has... She, her daughter also suggested that she should go storm chasing. And so, that's what she did. She chased storms and took pretty beautiful pictures of them. And then she learned all about, almost about them, and boom, she eventually took a picture of a tornado. I don't think this is a real tornado, so it looks so fake. By the way, it looks so fake. Then what happened? Well... That's about it. That's about how it works. So then, what's the use of a storm chaser? To know about a storm chaser, usually this is my advice, to be, to know about a storm chaser, be one. But since this is too dangerous to actually do and you're not going to be professional and take like years to become a professional storm chaser, I highly recommend to just watch videos and ask questions to real storm chasers or the storm chasers. I don't know know what to do then that's your problem so i hope you enjoyed this episode and if you did please like share and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already if you did get hit by lightning once and you survived and or got near closest and got, almost got hit by lightning then please write them in the comments below and also if you know any storm changes please write their names for me and also the date and including the year month and day of when you posted that comment, please, because it's really useful to me. And if you can't, write me an email to zero gr at neighbor.com. See you! Shinhan out. Peace!